came out against the Central Raiders, Iowa Western looking for its third straight win. Donovan Walker starts the game with a layup and misses, and Jaquan Lake with the jam. <laughs> Pat Dembley kicks it out to Terrence Ward who throws it up. Markwell Beasley with the putback, 23-22 home team, midway in the first half. Walker drives, Lake with the tip in, Jaquan with the game high 38 points. The Reavers pass it around, Dembley lobs the ball to Lake. The sophomore slams it with authority. They blew up by three at half, 43-40. Iowa Western out rebounding the Raiders by 15. To start the half, Alex Peacock passes down to Lake and the big man delivers. Right. But don't close out with your hands down. Hey, get up there with your hands up, make them go by. Oh, Andre Harris pulls up for three late in the half, 97-66. Iowa Western crushes Central 100-73. Tonight was a night we had to get back to playing how we play. And uh, with conference looming next week, you know, I thought the last half of basketball today was really good. Uh, just being aggressive, getting, to, getting on the boards, grabbing rebounds, you know. Uh, my matchup wasn't really a competitive matchup, but I scored the ball. Well. You know, we always talk about the next opponent. And so the next opponent is Indian Hills. And, and we've got to prepare the same way. And it's much like I just answered the question about Daquan. You know, he had a big night because he prepares every day for that kind of effort. And so it's nothing special we're going to do. We're not going to do anything differently. We're going to be able to do the same thing that we've been doing, and that's where you can find your strength and your confidence. Big Blue stays unbeaten at home. Iowa Western looks ahead to 24th ranked Indian Hills. For the Bluff Sports Zone, I'm Riley Martin.